Okay, so a bit of Chelmsford City, Sunday afternoon, fairly low grade affair, only 86 grand match on this market so far, um, pretty weak, quite early, don't want to get in too early, although I'm, I'm, I'm teetering on getting involved here because I'm sitting watching this and we've got Electric Qatar, which seems to be a bit of point of support in the market, and Save My Bacons took a little bit of money recently as the live shows just started there. Now, let's bounce back out. Of the two, I thought Electric Guitar is looking a little bit stronger at this stage. I'm not 100% sure yet, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dive in. In fact, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, so... I missed a couple of ticks there already. Um, so not for the best start. But Save My Bacon's um, bounced back out, and uh, hopefully that will stay out, which will allow this Electric Guitar to come in. Because these two are... Uh, Working against each other because they both seem to be taking a little bit of support in the market. Um, in you know, in comparison to the others, they're taking more support than the rest of the market. So I'm just going to take a little bit of that out there, um, five three, because I've I've dived in a little bit quick. Um, obviously, I didn't want to miss out on getting on. Um, I didn't want it to go flying off past where I'll, where I wanted to get on and um, completely miss everything. So we're on at around about 5.4, 5.5 now actually, now, now that lay figures out. So hopefully to save my bacon will drift through 4.0 um, which will be a better position for us, it will leave, leave me feeling a little bit more comfortable. I'm just going to phase out a couple of 20s there, just, just reduce the stakes a little bit. This is Chelmsford City and it is a Sunday afternoon and it is pretty weak so you know things can change quite quickly and the market can rip back in the opposite direction so for that reason I'm not going to be sitting here on large stakes and to be honest there's absolutely no need to when when the markets are fairly volatile because they move more so that that should get filled any second now at 5.1 hopefully so we'll, we'll get back in at 5.2 so you see um, it's almost like a reverse scalp I'm still going with the trend of it coming in it's like a reverse scalp but it seems to be drying up a little now um, we're testing the 4.0 and save my bacon which if this bounces if save my bacon bounce back um, or even there's a bit more support for arctic links I'll probably flip sides on this trade, it's what I'm thinking at the moment, it's looking like everything's going to grind into a halt, it's a case of is there more support for electric guitar, very short term view, this is very short term view, and if there's not then I'm going to have to bounce back in the alternate direction, um, so I've got a couple of very small stakes above possible exits if it does rip back, um, maybe it's not going to now actually, so my bacon's going to go through the four and solidify there. So. This is this is the peak point of activity within the market. So it's Chelmsford City. Obviously, it's, it's not great anyway. Um, but three minutes to post. You can see them on the TV now. And although that's took a bit of support, electric guitar, it can't carry on supporting forever unless it's a case of the others are very weak and there's a lot of support. Now there's not a lot of support. Oh, might be slightly wrong there. But I'm going to try and catch a bottom here and catch it bounce back. So I've identified a little bit of money. The rest of the market's firming up a little bit, so um, that's where we're at at the moment. Now, oh, get out there at four eight, maybe not. This could this could teeter for a second or two, but I'm I'm actually thinking now there's not enough support for this electric guitar for it to carry on steaming. Um, but I'm not <laughs> so confident. I'm happy to lay it for a large stake either. Just keeping an eye on the TV. We've got a little. I've got a couple of minutes to start. But this is electric guitars, the only really interesting runner for me in this market at the moment now. Now, say by Bacon's drifted like that because it's the only runner that I'm actually seeing and feeling general money, uh, gen genuine money on. Sorry, and I, I personally, the way I trade, I like to trade the genuine money that bit more. And I don't want to be battling with other traders. So that's never fun. Um, so just get on the back side there. I know, I know, I'm at the bottom of the queue on. Um, 4.4 on close to the bottom, so it should get matched. Brilliant. Okay. So you have to be very careful because I could well be right here and it flits back against me and I make a mess of the position that I'm in. So, come on, let's get filled. Doesn't feel. You can just see some of the traded volume bars on the left there. I'm going to have to get out there at 4 or 5. The traded volume bars on the sorry on the left on the right of the column for electric guitar. You can see that there's been money come in. You can see that the resistance has built up at 4.5. Um, it's where 12k is been matched, the majority of the money, and it, it's sort of struggling to get past that. So that's why I'm more happy to be laying around about them prices. When I'm doing this and I'm trying to scalp out a couple of ticks, I'm only ever going to offer a price. There's no point taking the actual price because you, you're doing yourself out of a tick. Um, I'm, I'm rambling a bit there and, and just. Just putting these in favourable positions, it's just 
dipping down and see that's giving me another five of that as might not get away with that. In fact I'll probably be able to get another tick out of this I reckon. Should bounce up. Hopefully I'll get out four eight maybe. Oh, might be pushing me luck. Uh but the market's uh, in full flow now and the favourites actually got a little bit of money coming in which is helping us. So we should yeah we're gonna get filled with four eight there I would have thought. Go go take him in play SP just in case. Which is always a good move to do as well people because if um if the race goes off and the TV is a couple of seconds behind and you've got to take SP, you'll get a match and not be chasing around in play. A couple more quid. Sorted. And the Angel Way's got a few few quid there. It's bounced back. It's gone a hell of a drift, that one, throughout the day. It's bounced back just at post time, which is not unusual either. But there we are. We're in. The race is off. Um, and we've just got to hedge up. Have a jabby. 30 quid. Small stakes. Volatile markets on a Sunday. Still worth a go.